Hello everyone, it's lovely to be able to connect with you and to hope and to say that I hope you're all well. These are strange times for us as individuals and certainly for us as a church. The development team um, want to be a resource to you uh, as much as we possibly can. So what we've done, we've put together this short video uh, from each member of the development team which sets out the sorts of resources that we can offer you even in these uncertain times and virtually via the internet. From a personal perspective, I've really enjoyed uh, going out and meeting you in your parishes uh, and talking to your vestries about parish development. I look forward to doing that whenever the restrictions are lifted. But in the meantime, I'm really willing to have uh, an either a telephone conversation or a Zoom conversation with you uh, to talk about parish development and how that can even progress even in these days of restrictions. So please feel free to contact me for those discussions. I want to also say that there are many ways to contact your parishes and parishioners, even if there's no facility for video or internet. Uh, so there's, a, there's something that I've been looking at called Network of Kindness, that again, I would love to have the opportunity to chat with you about. If you are doing some community engagement, I've done some research and there are some funding bodies out there who are willing to fund you to do that important work. So again, if you contact me, uh, I'll be able to signpost you in that direction. I'm also conscious that at this time, all cler the clergy have some time in their hands that maybe uh, you could use for your own personal development. So there's there's lots of books on that, on leadership, that I'd love to refer uh, you to, uh, to help you on your journey and in these days to maybe learn a little bit more about leadership and community development. So those are just some of the things that I'd love you to contact me about. Uh, the contact details are on the website. Uh, my, you can either use the phone or send me an email and we can set up a Zoom chat really love to you to connect with me uh, so that we can talk further about all of these things and maybe other things uh, that you would like me uh, to help you with. So I want to hand you over now to the development team. Hello, my name is Christina Bailey and I am the Diocesan Youth Officer in Connor. At the moment, um, Connor Youth are doing a number of different things to encourage young people and youth ministry. The first thing is that we're doing online um, gatherings for youth leaders. Um, we're going to do this regularly and it will provide an opportunity to share ideas and encourage each other. We want to provide a supportive space for the youth leaders who are regularly discipling our young people in our parishes. The second thing is we are going to be developing a resource called Right Now to share stories of faith at the minute that are relevant to what is happening in the world right now. There will be lots of videos and different content that will be available to youth leaders for them to share with their young people. There'll be lots of friendly faces from across the diocese that'll be, that will be involved in this um, and we'd love for you to use it with your groups. The third thing, um, as unfortunately our summer events are cancelled, um, we'll be seeking to reflect those online, but we've also launched our applications for Connor Takes the Castle in September. And would really encourage groups to look at that as an opportunity to come along together. Please feel free to contact me if there's anything that I would be able to do to support your leaders or you in your youth ministry. Hi everyone, I'm Jill Hamilton, the children's worker for the diocese. Now, like the rest of the development team, I have been having a think about how best to support churches during these weeks of lockdown and thinking ahead to possible months of social distancing. Um, now many of the churches have been using the All Aboard programme with their children and therefore I thought a good idea would be to do some online sessions of the All Aboard programme. Now the idea is that the children can watch and take part in an online Sunday school lesson and then there's also going to be some accompanying resources which I'll put up on the Connor Diocesan website and also on the Ripple website. So here's a flavour of what I mean.
The All Aboard online video sessions will include explanations or demonstrations of all the activities in each session, including activities which lead children into the story, a video or retelling of the Bible story, a quiz or a challenge, and a prayer idea. There will also be accompanying activities on the Diocesan and Ripple websites, including discussion questions, puzzle sheets, and various craft ideas linked to the story. I hope the sessions will be enjoyable and beneficial for the children in your parish. These All Aboard online sessions will be weekly and will take us through until the end of June. And then during the summer holidays, we have plans to put together an online holiday Bible club if needed at that stage. And we'll give you more details closer to the time. Thank you. Hi everybody, uh, this is a big hello from the Centre of Mission in North Belfast. Stephen and myself have been managing under this very difficult circumstances to keep going with our Baby Basic project because obviously people are still having babies. So we've been able to support the local community in that way. We've also had other families in crisis who are looking for nappies, wipes and that. We also Stephen has kept going with the community garden up in Glen Cairn. But how can we help you, the wider diocese? How can we support you during these times of weeks and months ahead of restriction? I'm going to hand over to Stephen now, who's going to share those two ideas. As Karen said, we have two different courses that we can offer you. The first one is Faith Pictures. And Faith Pictures looks at helping us to share our faith in very practical ways, using real life examples, down to earth examples, trying to help us to learn to uh, talk about our faith openly and in very normal down to earth ways. That can work with big groups um, or it can work with smaller groups um, and we can do that all online. The, the other course is one called Reunion. Um, and it's similar in theme, uh, it's about sharing our faith and growing in evangelism, but it's a bit more in depth than the faith pictures and it would work better with really smaller groups um, of three or four people um, where we listen to teaching and material uh, and then share some thoughts together. So if you're interested in either of these, please get in touch. Is, is it me now? Is it me? Oh, <clears throat> hello. Karen and Stephen said to tell you all about some videos we could do using the puppets. That's me and my friends. So that you might show them on your church service online or you might want to show it to your kids. So if you want to know anything more, just get in touch with Stephen and Karen. Yay!